Well, this is our last episode of the year, so it is time to rewind to our first episode. We started off as some random kids chosen to experiment with creating a school news channel. We have had a lot of ups and downs creating this channel to pass down from generation to generation. We were so happy to be the original cast of HME TV. So, without further ado, here's our very last student spotlight. Hi, I'm here with our final student spotlight. So what are y'all's names? Gabby. Isabel. It's really nice to meet y'all. So we heard y'all are both on student council. How are y'all's opinions on that? I think it's going to be fun. Me too. I'm excited, most of all, to be able to help the school while also being able to work with most of my friends. That's going to be fun. Student council is amazing. Let's know a little bit more about y'all. What is y'all's favorite animal? Strangely enough, it's a giraffe. Um, dogs. Um, what is your favorite color? Teal. Blue. And last but not least, how do you like Harper McCon? I like Harper McCon more than any other school I've been to. Specifically because the teachers and the school board is very, very nice and the lunch year is great. Yep. I like Harper McCon because like I have a lot of friends here. Like, this is really nice. Too. Okay, you're from um it's Mel and Gabby. Now back to y'all at the station. I'm going to miss meeting all those cool and amazing students, aren't you, Xander? Of course! Let's shift over to our last teacher spotlight now. Hi, I'm Lizzie. I'm here with Miss Chogger. So, we have some questions for you because you're our last teacher spotlight. Okay, I'm excited for that. Go ahead. What do you like about your class this year? Uh, my class is very unique. There's a lot of different kinds of kids in here. I kind of refer it to the breakfast club, so that's interesting. Very interesting. Are you excited for your new class? Yes, I'm excited to get some new fifth graders. I hear great things about them. I can't wait to meet them next year. Um, what do you like about your bosses? Uh, I feel like they're very easy to talk to. If I have any problems, I can come to them. So, great bosses. Very nice. And? The biggest question that we all want to hear. Did you like HME TV? The yes. jokes are my favorite, so yes. Whoever does the jokes, you are awesome. <laughs> well, that's all for our teacher spotlight for the rest of this year. Back to the station. Let's now turn off the spotlights for the last time and head to the last riddle. Hey, peeps, this is Grace with the riddle and Xander. Okay. Anyway, so today's riddle is what key is hardest to turn? A donkey. Yeehaw. That was our very last riddle to solve. Can you believe it? I'm really gonna miss struggling to solve that. <laughs> Kendall, please stop embarrassing yourself. Aww. On the last episode too. Mm mm. Okay, okay. Let's head over to our last on-screen argument. <laughs> hey everybody, uh, my name is Lee, and today we are here with All You Mean Arena. We have, is Batman better or is Superman better? What are your thoughts on the case? Um, I think Batman is better. I mean, he does have this, like, symbol in the sky to just call him, but Superman really doesn't. Uh, now in a fight, who do you think would win? Probably Superman. Yeah, but now, if we had to do gadget against gadget, who do you think would win? Definitely Batman. All right. So that's all for the Batman side of the story. We're not gonna move on to the Superman side of the story. My bad. <laughs> uh, so we were now going to be discussing if Superman's better. What well, is your case on the opinion? I think Superman is better because he flies. Okay. Now, in a fight, who do you think would win? Superman. Okay. Now, if it were Gadget against Gadget, who would win? Batman. But overall, who do you think is just the better superhero? Well, I guess Superman. Alright, so that's it for the Superman side of the story. We will now be closing this case with the percentages later on.
We are now here with the percentages. It seems that Batman has gotten 42, while Superman has got 58. That was interesting. Now for the moment you've been waiting for. The new, fantastic, and talented, 2024 to 2025 HMETV cast. Let's look at the list now. Are you excited for the summer vacation? Absolutely. But before we can get off out for the summer, we have to finish this episode. Right, now we have the 2023-2024 HMET, HMETV cast or cast final words. You know me by now. Uh, this is our last time seeing each other, but this was a very good year. And for that, I have a very good saying. This is my last see you at the station. Hey guys, this is Brody, and this is a quote I want for everybody. Remember, this isn't the end. It's just the new beginning. Keep it up. See, I want my final goodbyes. And when that's something funny, though, if this one, you'll quote me on this. If anything ever happened to HBTV, it went wrong, you can say Xander started it. <gasps> <laughs> that's my final goodbyes. It's it's see y'all. Leave it to keep it. Hi, I'm Elizabeth, and it's Stay a Form, Stay Ahead, signing out. Bye. Hey, peeps, this is Grace, signing off. Waffle fries. Waffle fries. Waffle fries. I apologize for all of my mispronunciations, stutterings, and talking at the speed of light. But anyway, this is Kendall signing off. I'm Xander, and I'm signing off. But before I sign off, I have something to tell y'all. I'm so happy I love K-pop. Finally, to the end of this episode, right? We have the joke. What does a jalapeno do? Get all up in your business. Before we sign out for the last time, let's look at some behind the scenes segments and some bloopers. In three, two, one, go. Well, hello. Wow, great job, Larkin. Now we have Grace. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness. Recognition. 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 She's like doing it into a little rack. She's doing it into a little rack. Ready? Oh, I didn't. Oops. Oh my god. Welcome to HME TV. I'm Kendall, your host. Hi, Elizabeth, and hi. I'm Michaela with the riddle. Why? 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 I was gonna say. Unfortunately, unfortunately, all good things must come to an end. We hope our influence affects everyone in the school in positive ways. Thanks for being an amazing. Uh, an amazing audience this year and supporting us and watching our videos we'll hopefully see you again soon and for the last time remember believe, believe it to achieve it. it bye wait can we actually do that all